Hi, I'm Heidi Lee, and I'm here at the Hub Culture Pavilion with Sport Max in New York City. I'm pleased to be here with the wonderfully talented artist Ellen Harvey. Thank you so much for being here, and um, I'd like to talk a little bit about your, your art and your artistic process, if you don't mind. Um, Ellen Harvey was in the Whitney Biennial in 2007. She has had a close relationship with the museum for many years, so um, if you could talk about, about your work, uh, that would be great. Well, um, first of all, thank you very much for asking me. Um, it's a pleasure to get to, to talk with you, as always. And um, well, I think it's, it's interesting that you were saying before that this um, is sort of about the idea of people who have influence in their particular world, I guess in this case, the art world, mm -hmm. which to me is incredibly flattering, the idea that I have any influence whatsoever. I suspect it's not the case, but... Um, but uh, What's interesting to me is the sort of idea that art is this part of is part of part of a larger conversation and mm -hmm. it's part of a larger cultural conversation. Mm -hmm. And so of course everyone influences everyone else. Right. So what changes, you know, as you progress, maybe the venues get better. You know, you start to you do something like the Whitney Biennial and obviously a lot more people um, see it than when you're first showing in your friend's cafe. Um, you know, every order to start somewhere. Would you say that that was um, a breakthrough moment in your career, one of many, or and how, how do you how would you describe that experience? It was very exciting, certainly. I mean, it was in two thousand and eight, and I was I was thrilled. Um, right. and it was also great to get to do pieces that involved the audience. I did a performance piece, um, so it was really fantastic to have that kind of conversation. And also to remember, you know, myself so vividly what it's like to be a younger artist and you go to see the biennial and of course you're furious with the whole thing and wish that you were in it and would be much better if you were in it, obviously. And then for once to actually be in it was, was very exciting. But I don't know if it was really a breakthrough. I mean, I feel like things have been more sort of slow and steady. In slow general. and steady. So it, it is very interesting to, to learn about how your art is really about environments and experiences and more so than the object itself and something that's a um, tangible commodity in a way. So you're subverting that commercial aspect of the market. Um, and you, uh, you, have a, you have a show coming up at the Bass Museum. Um, tell us a little bit about that and when it is. Um, that's going to be in, this, be in the summer. Um, so I'm actually heading out there tomorrow to go and do the first site visit because it's going to be a, a site-specific work, which is something I very much enjoy doing. And, even though I'm a great fan of institutional critique, at the same time, I feel like you always have to kind of admit the fact that without the institution hadn't invited you, you'd never be able to do it. But so I'm going there to have a look at their collection and to think, which, which is a fascinating old master collection, Amazing. since I'm such a huge painting fan, it would be a lot of fun. Um, so I'm going out there to have a look and to try and think of something fun to do. I'm right now very, very tempted to do something about sort of the sort of nude body in art, especially given that it's Miami, which of course is such a, such a culture of physical perfection, right. um, which I find completely fascinating. It's very appropriate so, for it. But we'll see, we'll see. I'm, I, right now I have no idea yet. You know, they very bravely asked me to do a show and we all have no idea what I'm going to do yet. Well, it's great to see all these museums just vying for your work and you're in high demand now. So thank you again for coming. I really appreciate it. Ellen Harvey. My pleasure. Good luck. Thank you.